If there is an official soundtrack to Cobb County over the past generation, it is no doubt the drone of the C-130. It has been a fixture here in Cobb County for nearly 70 years. And out at Lockheed Martin's facility, at Dobbins Air Reserve Base, they took time off to recognize the 70th anniversary of the C-130's first flight. Happy anniversary! Yeah! Today we're celebrating the 70th anniversary of C-130's first flight back in 1954. It really is a significant milestone because it just signifies, you know, the role that the C-130 has played in global airlift operations across the globe, not only to our domestic customers, but our international customers. In addition, you know, the impact that this program has had to Cobb County, you know, we've delivered uh, economic impact of significant value have created high paying jobs for the Cobb County area in particular. You can't say C-130 without saying Marietta. It's uh, one and the same. So you're talking about something that's gonna always be a part of Cobb County. It's not going anywhere. It's a mainstay, it's a staple. Also at the ceremony, they recognized four Lockheed employees who have, get this, 60 years each of experience working the C-130 line. We've been growing the site. Currently, we have about 5,600 employees at this location, supporting not only just C-130, but also the F-35 center wing. We still have some very important operations for the F-22 aircraft. In fact, you know, this aircraft program is now the longest running military aircraft production program ever in history. So many times over the years, folks have said the time of the C-130 is past and the end is near. But in reality, as we pass 70 years, the end is not in sight. I would have told you in 2010 that we wouldn't be producing C-130Js in 2020. We're going to be producing C-130Js in 2035 and beyond. I think every milestone that the Herc reached should be celebrated. It's such a historic airplane, and it's going to be here 50, 70 years in the future.